Yo, what's good, gang? It is the thickest these boys back with another reaction. I am rapper Nate Rose. I'm director and filmmaker David Elijah Pearsall. Today, we're getting back to another Quedeca record. Guess who, baby? Guess who? And you know, in the comments, they said that this one's a more rap-centric record, so I'm I'm excited to see what that Someone is. Someone said ignorant rap, but that was he their said, words, but you know, I kind of want to hear something a little different. Facts, facts. Well, I, I mean, he's been getting real creative lately, and so I don't know, man. Without further ado, bro, let's mask up like we finna rob Let's mask something. up, baby. I love the Times New Roman like situation. <laughs> it's one of my favorite yeah. type of titles. These locations, bro. He's, he's just flexing yes. on us. Uh. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Look at the dance moves too. Brighten that screen up. Yo, the dance moves are hard. That shot's hard. Guess who? Watch that into the vein. Had to go through the back. Guess who? Guess who? Guess who? Heard it done? Yes, you. My man's always going to remarkable locations. Looking so tall next to all those all. Yo, let's let's talk about that because the remarkable locations number one it makes the videos better, but number two, he's just like yo, I want to travel the world. So what's a reason for us to do this? Oh, um, I'll just I will make a song and shoot a video for it in in these remarks. I don't I don't even know where this is. No, it looks like some sort of like France looks, location, but totally I agree with that. Yeah, I have no idea, but yeah, that's bro. lit. That's like some Super. stuff we would do for sure. Bet two, tell me who's that one in the middle of the night in your head that you never slept through? Yeah, huh. guess who just walked in the room? Oh, I love the zoom. Real in my confidence, fit. Brand new collection, it cost me a killing it, tucking it, killing it, cost me a minute. And I got lost, I'm rebuilding, I popped down the ceiling and made it a liminal space. Got liminal. Knock off the pins, my drop off the pins. Oh, that's a hard shot. I, I, okay. I just walked in, now you caught in the act. Uh, uh, okay, don't even care how you wanna react. Uh, uh, okay, think it's a choice cause I'm walking in that. Uh, okay, you missing the point. Like I'm seeing his versatility on this. So, okay, so I like I like the fact that he I love playing around with the mixing. Cause this is not a straight rap vocal. It still has like so much texture. It's a really dirty feel to it you know what i'm saying like his vocals are like distorted and they, they got this noise in them and then he has these like little like singing things in the background where the tuning's like kind of hard on it but it's like it feels digital is this a part of one album do you know i don't know i mean uh i know that they said the entire album is a, like a concept album i think this this is a fairly re recent release so i think it gotcha. is probably part of that but um it does have the same like sonic texture it does bro i mean i, I kind of want to tune into this whole record yeah yeah we might if have, it has we a might similar have texture y'all let us know but Ooh. um Ooh, but yeah initial, initial thoughts man what, do, what are you thinking about the song yo song it's crazy i agree with a lot of the things you were saying I definitely love the production um i listen to less music like that so when i hear it it's like very refreshing i love the flow of it um it also catches me off guard quite a bit yeah you know i'm expecting this because look what's popular right now is drake with a hard beat yeah. And just his voice over it. It kind of works as an instrument. Right. But with Quideca, what he's doing is like you have this hard beat and then all of a sudden it's nee, nee, nee. like you hear this like whole, I don't even know what the instrument's called. Yeah. Yeah. But what most excites me about him is that I can see the beginnings of someone who is going to do something great. Yeah. Some of the angle. First of all, shout out to the filmmakers. Um, I'm sure we'll get a credit at the end of this, but the composition on some of these shots is wild. The shots where he's like standing you know, in like a, it's super wide screen. He's like standing and there's a big building in the left thirds. And then yeah. in the right thirds, he's just like, yes. Well, dude, you know what well, I mean? Well, okay. No, actually there was a little VHS effect, but Very I was going to say a lot of these are static, bro. Like wh how crazy would it be if he just set these shots up himself? I mean, he's a crazy. YouTuber, bro. He has an eye for I something. I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm sure he does video, like, very well. Dude, I'll say this, too. I think that I like this one a lot, too, because this one has a bit more of a song structure than, like, Dust Cutter. Like, Dust Cutter was more like a conceptual piece that went through a bunch, like, a big arc. The interlude. These, the, yeah. Yeah. Now, this has just, like, a, you know what I'm saying, straight hook. We're getting the guess who. And also, like, the, I love how he just takes the space where he's like, uh, uh, yeah, or, like, whatever he was doing there. So Yo. Right, Before yeah. we get started, though, we got a we got a situation with a lot of static shots. We got a little film, uh huh, a little video. You want to show them a little something that we we did? We got to. All let's right, do, let's it. do it. 
They say money corrupt everything. I wonder if it's true. So I had to get a bunch of it to see what it could hit record. Started hustling way back when I wasn't from my passion early on, but now my peers was privy. I had an ego type of ego, make you win by busting through. Until that ego had me breaking ties with ones I knew. I killed that ego and got money hand in hand. Something new. That's that EQ that I learned while using EQ as a tool. So why? The fuck am I tripping? I used to feel the littest that some shit was popping for me. Now I'm just feeling convicted. I got friends. I grew up with that in here because addiction. I got friends that got kids and they still popping prescriptions. I got friends. I got. Stay into the video. Had to go through the back. Guess who went in and out? You see, didn't even know I'm back. Yeah, true. I play with the money and you pitch that money so loud. So loud. Yeah, true. That's enough to make somebody disappear when I stay tied up. That's my favorite one. Go ahead and take a shot. Take it away. You thought you could so stop. Stay in my beat if you put me in a box. Double check, cause it gotta be a hundred miles deep. Yeah, they think I change a lot, but I promise I'll leave. Even if the bounce is double takes, I'm out. Yeah, I'm still on top of that. So good, bro. I'm 19, get a mob that the in and out in a drop clean. Dropping tapes like I couldn't figure out a crime scene. My career fucking weird, can't even define me. What is this? Dropping tapes like I can't even figure out a crime scene. Is that what he said? Hold up, let me run it back a couple seconds. Man's throwing in here bars, ain't he? Dropping tapes like I couldn't figure out a crime scene. Hey, you know what? I, that just said it was the uh, the most replayed part because he's snapping right now. He's going stupid. He's going dumb. Figure out a crime scene. My career fucking weird. Can't even define me. Yeah. But it's still here. They said I was naive. Me, these pushing buttons, but never rewind me. Because they couldn't tell a masterpiece from a tight beat. Would you glorify interns in the side seat? Ooh, they're talking about you, Nick. <laughs> Goddamn. <laughs> we're packed out with the fans. Never backed out on my plans. Like I'm maxed out my she just passed out at the chance. I can't be mad about a couple ends. Okay, okay. Guess who? And this swagger, bro. Confidence. Guess who? And then and out. You see, they didn't even know that. Yeah, so I play with the money. You pitch some of that soul. Yeah, so that's enough to make somebody just pick up my pants on. Guess who? Guess who? Sweet. Guess who? Guess who? Sweet. Break out at the end. Sweet. Sweet. Yep, bro, fire I'll, record. I don't know if we talked about, but his vocal dexterity is crazy too, though. Yes. Like I know there's some they're doing some mixing magic that I'm not privy to. Now he's doing singing, rapping, screaming, all, all the the whole gamut. Guess who? Yeah, and he, yeah, and the falsettos and stuff, dude. Now nah, he's fire. I love this too. I said it before, and I'll say it again. He is. It, it's clear that he cares about the art because mm. a lot of YouTubers don't make that. You know what I'm saying? A lot of, there's a lot of people that try to move from one art form to another and they don't do the new art form justice because they're not as passionate about it as mm. they were the first thing. They were chasing it for a different reason. Right. The, I mean, you got Quadeca, but Joji, I mean, amazing example. I can't believe he went from Pink Boy to, right, to right. Joji and making the records he made. But this is, this to me is like, oh yeah, no, he's really trying to push music as an art. Like he's not, you know, and I know he utilized YouTube, and he was. I'm sure he's always cared about the music and the art, right? but I know he utilized YouTube as a platform. You know, um, but I think that that now he's like, all right, I'm big enough that mm -hmm. I can just do the like much more lean into just the experimental stuff, and I think that's fire. I like what you said about the traveling thing. I think that's very obvious. That's something I never thought about before. Like it's like I I respect that so much. It's like oh, let's just travel the world and just make. They're pretty simple by nature music videos yes. that look super dope. You know yeah. what I mean? It was just a flex in itself to be just standing in this location. You're like, okay, well, I know he, you know what I mean? It's bro, like every, thousand percent. Yeah. Yes, bro. So awesome, man. Well, hey, let us know what we should react to next. I'm digging Quedeca. What's the next one that we should do? Please let us know, man. Yo, if there's an album that we need to get into for this, we ain't done the research. So let us know in the comments because that might be the next move. Let's go, man. All right, gang. Till next time. Yeah, Peace. maybe need top five when I'm done going mental. Yeah, I'm locked in. You can peep my condition. I'm in the lab all winter. All summer. Yeah, I went dumb. Now I'm about to go dumb and throwing way more numbers on the board on mama.